Hi, George here, and we're going to improve the look of this portal right here by making a custom texture pack and changing the look of that obsidian. Okay, switch over to the desktop and gather the materials that we need. Here we go. The first thing you need is a place to build your new pack in. So I just made a new folder here on my C drive and I called it pack. Just a big blank folder to work in. We now need to grab the texture file that we'll be working with. So for that, let's go back to the launcher. There we go. I'm currently in the Java edition right here. Go up to installations and at the top line here, latest release, we're making this for 119.3 right there. Go over here, see that folder icon right there just to the right of the play button. Click on that and it opens up the Minecraft folder in here. And then here, scroll down until you find versions, which is right here. Go into versions and then find your version. We want 119.3, which is right there. Let's go inside of that. And you should see two files in here, a jar file and a JSON. If you don't see the .jar and .json, then go up here to view and come down to show and put a check right here next to file name extensions right there. This is Windows 11. If you're in Windows 10, then just go up here to the top, click on view and over here someplace you'll find a checkbox for file name extensions, same thing. Okay, we want this jar file and I wanna copy this over to our working folder. So let's bring that working folder up. There it is. And I'll just right drag this in here and copy. Okay, we're all set. Let's get this out of the way. We'll come back to that later. Now this is just a zip file. So I want to change this from .jar to .zip. So click into the name a couple of times. Let's click in once, click in a second time like that. And then backspace over where it says jar and change that to say zip and choose yes. Okay, now right click on this and open in new window right here. There we go. I'm going to change the view up here to make it easier to see this. Let's just go here to list. And the first thing you want is in this first folder here, go way over into the P section over here and you want that pack PNG. Just right drag it over here and copy. That's just that grass block image that's used as a thumbnail for your resource pack. You can do anything you want. You can do your own image if you want to. This is just a square picture. 128 by 128, and it's a PNG file. That's all it is, nothing special about that. Okay, so go back in here again, and then go into Assets, then into Minecraft, and here come down to Textures down here, and inside of Textures, go into Block right here, and we want the Obsidian block, so I'll just scroll down to find that, and it's right there. Okay, right drag that over here, and copy. Here's our block. We now need to make our folder structure. And you'll see that right here at the top, Assets, Minecraft, Textures, and Block. I'm gonna put this right here. And let's put this right underneath. And we'll just copy these folders right down here in our working file. So, new folder. First one is Assets. There we go, go inside of that one. New folder. Second one is Minecraft. There we go, inside of that one new folder. Next one is textures. Here we go. Inside of that one, new folder. And this one's block. Okay, that gets our structure in here. Let's go back to the main folder here, pack. So there's our folders all set to go. We have our pack PNG. We have our obsidian image. Let's grab one more thing before we work with the obsidian picture. And that's just that we need a pack.mc meta file. Minecraft used to include that. They no longer do. So I have that up on my website. Let's go ahead and grab that. And this right here, I'll put this link in the description and also on the page right here. And if you wanna code your own, there it is right there. Or easy way, just come down here and download it. This is all set to go. In 119.3, the pack format is 12. I'll just click on this and we'll download this into that same folder. Choose save. And there we go, that's done. Okay, let's now right click on this one, open a new window. And there's a pack MC meta file. Just drag it over here. You can then delete that zip file. And that's that right there. Okay, so that's all set to go. We can now close this down and we can close this down. We can have all the parts that we need to make our new resource pack. So let's now go ahead and change the look of this. We'll be doing this with an online editor this time. And we'll be using Pixlr. This is a free tool. Just go ahead and Sign up and then log in. I'll just log in right now, right here. 
Then we'll use the advanced photo editor right here in the middle. Gives us the most options. Let's just get this out of the way. There we go. And we'll open up an image. Now set Obsidian PNG right there, choose open. Now it's real small, we need to zoom in on this thing. Very small image, there we go. And if you want to, you can make this image bigger, so you have a bit better resolution. Go to page, come down to resize page, that's just scaling it. I'll make this one twice as big, 32 by 32. And uncheck smoothing, we don't want to have that on there, just uncheck that and choose apply. There we go, just a little bit better resolution this way. And what I want to do is just to make this a bit more exciting, I'm going to change the coloration here, make it brighter, make it more yellow, more of a gold-like look. And we'll do that up here at the adjustment section. Come down to hue saturation. And here we can change things. The hue is the color. Just kind of slide it back and forth till you find what you want. Want something kind of in the yellows, it's right in here someplace. Bring the saturation way up, this is the brightness of things. And let's colorize that, sometimes that works better. And more saturation. And let's find a good yellow in here. Right about in there, I have mine sitting here at 136, negative 136. Just apply on that. Now I wanna make it brighter. Back to adjustments in here. Let's come down to brightness and contrast. And let's bring our brightness up. That's looking better. I think I'll leave the contrast alone. So full brightness, contrast alone. That's a lot nicer, much more like what I want on this. Let's see if we can do anything else on that. Need a little bit more vibrance in here. Let's try this, add a bit more vibrance. Just a little bit better, see it's a, kind of a better look there. We'll go clear to the top on that one and apply. There we go, it's a lot brighter, a lot more gold looking, like it's kind of made out of gold as opposed to made out of obsidian. So we'll save this, file save. We'll keep it at the PNG right here and save as, and let's now put it into the right folder. Still in pack, let's go inside of assets, Minecraft textures block, and save it right here, choose save, and that's done. Okay, close that down, and we're all set. We've now changed the look. Let's now finish off our resource pass. Let's go back over to the desktop for that. Okay, one thing here to do with the pack MC Meta. I have mine opening up in Notepad++. It's really good for this kind of fast editing. Let's bring that up right here. Now, pack format is already okay if you downloaded the right one. And just change the name up here. And I'll call this one Obsidian. There we go. And we'll save that. That's all done. We can now build the resource pack. And with this folder over here, hold the control key down, grab that pack MC Meta and that pack PNG or your own if you're using your own pack PNG. Right click and compress to zip file. This is Windows 11, just like that. If you're in Windows 10, you go up here, there's a share tab, and then you'll find zip up there. Okay, I'll give this thing a name. There we go, Obsidian Zip. And we're all set. We can now put this into the game and test it out. I'll put that right over here. Go back to the launcher, back to the folder. And this time, let's come down until you find the resource packs is right here, open this one up, and then let's just take that zip file and drag and drop it in here. There it is, that's done. Get this out of the way. We can go ahead and play this now and test it out. Now my game's already running, so let's go back to the game. Here we are, let's go into Options, into Resource Packs, and you should see your new pack over here, left-hand side, there it is Obsidian. Click on the arrow, comes over here, right-hand side, that's good, done. And done again, now I have a special pack in here to change my colors in here. If you wanna find out how I did this stuff, I'll put links for that in the description. Choose done, back to game. And there we go. There's our nice gold tone obsidian using that real easy to make custom resource pack. Okay, if you like this video, hit that like button. Make sure you click on share, click on subscribe. If you wanna help keep my channel going, take a look at joining my Patreon. There's a link for that right down there in the description. And I'll see you next time.